I'm right in the heart of Moscow and right in the middle of the Russian winter holiday season. Now, what does that mean? It's an incredibly long, amazing period. It starts off with our Christmas, which actually more and more people are celebrating here now. And then we have the big one. We have Russian New Year which is an amazingly amazing festival that I cannot even describe. After that, we have Russian traditional Orthodox Christmas to come. But that's not all. After people have gone back to work, about a week later, then we have the Russian Orthodox New Year. So, if you're like me, you like celebrations, you like holidays, come to Moscow next season. See you then. But it's quite nippy tonight, it's about minus five. But do you know something, just walking down this street, I'm kind of forgetting about the temperature and just, I'm just amazed. I'm just looking at this line, pretty much amazed at this light show. Pretty cool, really. I think it's probably one of the world's most underestimated cities, Moscow. And you can definitely see this on a time like this, Christmas, New Year, and you have these incredibly expensive decorations up everywhere. There's the Lenin Museum right behind me. I'm standing on Revolution Square in the middle of Moscow and children are having a great time on a roundabout. Last year, 12 million people came to Moscow during this holiday period, and they spent quite a lot of money here. They spent a billion dollars. Uh, 700 million dollars alone were spent on Moscow's hotels and restaurants. By all accounts, at least 12 million people have already visited Moscow this year. The Moscow city government really pulled all the top out this year. Apparently they hired an extra 2,000 people to put this whole thing together. Ah, here's my friend Simon. Hi, John. Simon, great to How see you. you. Happy New Year. Happy New Year, mate. Well, what do you think about the, all this decoration and stuff? Uh, they're really nice. I've actually just come back from London just really? before Christmas. So yeah. I've had the um, best of both worlds, really, um, because I was able to see the Christmas lights in Oxford yeah. Street and other local towns. Yeah. But I've got to say, these are better. 
It's just certainly a lot of them, aren't yeah, they? They've really sort I mean, of gone to town this year, absolutely. haven't they? Absolutely. Tverskaya is lovely. I mean, yeah. back there was gorgeous around Lubyanka, yeah. down here. It's just yeah. super effort, actually. Yes, yeah, sir. So, I mean, um, it's quite something, mm. though, isn't it? All this, all this stuff, all this money they spent, all the effort they put into it. What kind of, um, what kind of emotions is it? Does well, it summon up in you? In my opinion, it puts all the people in Moscow will be very happy to see all these lights. Yeah. It's very obvious to me that the government has made a lot of effort and spent a lot of money creating a very nice atmosphere. Puts people obviously in a very good mood. Yeah. Um, and I have to say, if I really compare the two, Moscow comes, comes out well on top of um, London in this one. <laughs> so, you, it's, but you don't think it's over the top or anything like that? No, not at all. I mean, it's something that uh, Russian people have come to expect. Mm. Um, and they love it. Mm. It's all part of the, um, the New Year Christmas celebrations. Which they do right. so well here. It's become a sort of traditional thing. Well, yeah. I, I love it. I've been here for nearly 16 years and uh, I'm still highly impressed by it. Yeah. 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 So I'm great to see you again. Lovely Happy Christmas. You, Happy New Year. <laughs> yes, Smoth and God and Torsha. Thank you very much. Lovely to see you. See you again. Have a nice bye bye. rest of the Thank year. Thank you. Bye bye. So as you can see, it's a lot of fun in Moscow during the winter holidays, but it's a little bit chilly, I've got to say. But don't worry, Moscow city government's official policies is to have fun and games and celebrations the whole year round. Almost every month, there's some sort of holiday happening here. So pack your bags, get out to Moscow and have fun. <laughs> <laughs>